game one. Let's see if it carries over here into game two of this series tonight. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. Well, the moment of truth is almost upon us here. They are about to drop the puck. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time, you want to take space. Goaltender does it, makes the save. We're still in the early stages of this period. Still no score on this one. Here's a chance to set up now. Oh, tremendous reflexes with the pad. What a stop by Hellebuck. Moves it quickly over to Johns. A chance on foot. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. From the right side and up the middle. Moves it around along the half wall. Incredible reflexes on the glove save by Hellebuck. Hellebuck's a goalie that seems to get better the more shots he faces, guys. His workhorse zone ability means he can find his rhythm and make stop after stop as they keep coming his way. The Jets have it from their own end. Excellent stick work on the play. Slides it quickly to Silverberg. Minnesota's ready to go on the attack. And that's a great defensive heads up to force the turnover. Dished on over to Velarde. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Tries to the crease. How did he stop that one? You always have those players who keep the play alive. Trying to gain a step. All alone. What a save on the play. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. You know I stepped on your toes there, James, but had to react to that massive hit. Moves it to Appleton. Takes the feed. Oh, what a hit! He sacrificed his body to make the play! He knew exactly what he was doing with that hit this early in the game. He's trying to send a message and dictate the pace. Angles it over to Ehlers. The Jets looking against the half wall. Stops him with the ball! Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Minnesota's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Oh, what a hit against the boards! Executed perfectly, James. I mean, he can't maneuver. He's got nowhere to go. He's lined up, and then he's taken down. Front. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. save as we look at that last save again james it is absolutely incredible and so impressive to see a goaltender just out battle and out will his opponent to find the puck offense is on face off and he wins the draw the whistle will get a face off after the goalie covers up they take possession as he locks him up off the face off slides it over to Johns Hellebuck's gonna hang on for a whistle
Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Still scoreless in this one. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. Poked away in the neutral zone by Burns. Looks to set up at the point now. And that banks off a stick. Nice zone entry from the left. Puts it on net. Oh, what a save on the clapper. Quick feed to Connor. Rocks him on the play. Fantastic save. Crisps all over that shot makes an incredible save. Getting to the top of his crease quickly. Because that shot, it came fast and in a hurry from the spot. Huge steal in his own end. Across the line. Takes a shot. Let's have a look at that last save again. It was absolutely incredible. You're under pressure, you're under attack, really under siege, and you find a way to get to the puck. This is the stop that champions are made of. More than half the period has expired. The game is still scoreless. Perfetti's quick stick off the draw wins possession. The Jets have it now. On the left side of both in the middle of the ice. Fires it on net. Glove save. Moves it to Niederreiter. Big play inside the defensive zone. Appleton's lugging the puck. Here's a short pass to Ehlers. Minnesota's in transition. The Wild have the puck against the boards. Now a quick pass to Vanek. Winnipeg's looking to break out of their own end. And he takes the dish. Good hit. The Jets move the puck in the defensive zone. From the left side, takes it at center. Quick pass to Morrissey. And that's a smart heads-up play. But trying to gain his step. He's in! Uh, I thought he could have shot the puck, James, but he elects to deke, and when he dekes, he just isn't able to outweigh the tender who's able to make the save. And now he moves it quickly to DeMello. Great hit on the play. Picked up along the wall by DeHaan. Chason moving the puck through his own zone. The Jets carry it along the wall. Oh, he made the save! How did he stop it? James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound athleticism and desperation got him back in to make it. And he slides it quickly to Kane. Takes the feed. Oh, what a slick stop by Hellebuck. And he cuts up big again. As a goaltender, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. Getting into the later stages of this period, we've still got zeros on the board. Winnipeg's won the defensive zone draw. And that's off a stick. Moves it quickly over to Stahl. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Sends a pass over. Moves it to Stahl. Oh, what a save with the glove! The Hans got the puck in his own zone. The Jets played along the wing. Slides the puck down low. Passes it in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Teams are ready for the draw. The line's been about to drop the puck. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. Take it along the wall by Burns. Collision there. He just got railroaded. Close space, so. Yeah, you can see this one coming, Cheryl. Yeah, and you hate to see this, James. A player down, never the look you want, but you also know that it has to be responded for. There has to be action when a guy's on the ice.
There's the takedown, and I think that might be kind of a mercy rule there, right, Cheryl? It's a mercy rule as they're exhausted, and you can see them as they're panting. But what it does mean is that the officials can come in and just break it up. The Jets playing very aggressive. That fight right there just showing that they're sending a message, trying to gain some energy, silence the crowd, and really dictate the play. Both teams had a chance for a little reset as they step in for the faceoff. Can they take advantage after winning that draw? Off a stick. Pass back to the point. Takes a shot. Well saved made by Hellebuck. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Hellebuck's rock solid between the pipes. He can go on his team and give them a chance to win on a nightly basis. Silverberg's one-timer is one of the best in the league. That's his one t zone ability. And you know his teammates will be looking to set him up. Let's see if one of these stars can keep their team the upper hand in this matchup. Back to you now. That's it for period number one. Second period action coming up in moments here on EA Sports. ready to drop the puck. Here we go. Period number two is now underway. But these fans are clamoring for the first goal of this one. Easily turned away by the goalie's glove. Hellebuck's one of those goaltenders that the busier he gets, the more efficient he becomes, and it's save after save as his confidence grows and he's more dialed into the game. And the puck skips away after that move. Peter Ive is so difficult to stop in tight, and he's got magic hands with him. Up 
here. Just bone crushing, separating body from puck. The Wild have gained control of the puck along the wall. Centering pass! And that's stopped! Sends the pass over. Oh, textbook puck check to turn that over. Up along the wing. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. The Wild have gained possession off the wall. Tries to feed it over to Heinola. Can't connect good use of the body on that play. Here's a pass to the middle. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Levels it with the hit. As a power forward in the game, you go north south, and guess what? You deliver bone crushing hits just like that one. Pumped away from danger. The Wild have possession along the boards. Here's a short pass to Johns. Shot! That's gloved by Hellebuck. The goaltenders are the last line of defense for a reason, and this time, he bails his team out. Minnesota's coaches were preaching lots of shots on net, and they have done it and lead as a result here in the second. Granlin's won the draw, now look to set up. The Wild have taken control of the puck. And he makes the save on that play. Past the midway mark in this period. Minnesota's ahead, 1-0. Grandlin's won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. He grabs the puck here on the board. Scores! Shelling. Niederreiter's got it along the wing. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck now. Quick pass to Niederreiter. Hammers one. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Minnesota's in on the offensive attack now. Big time save on a big time shot. A chance on goal. What a great job of trapping the puck. Not one, but two consecutive saves. Grabbed along the board by Chason. Great use of the stick here at center ice. Minnesota's got the puck against the half wall. And he slides it quickly to Burns. That was amazing. What a save by Hillebuck. Good stand-up hit on the play. Barron's carrying it ahead. Minnesota's got a hold of it against the wall. He says, let's get physical on that play. And that pass attempt is deflected. Along the board, they battle for the puck. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. Blocked in traffic. And that goes wide. That one's a squeaker, James. Almost as if you need a curler squeaker to get that one past the post, because that one just glided straight through. And look at this. All sorts of pressure here building. Makes the save. And it's taken by the D. Minnesota's got the puck along the wall. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Quick pass across to Stahl. 
That's some smart heads up defensive play by Morrissey. The Jets are doing a great job of anticipating the play, and that's why the puck is on their stick. They're intercepting pucks all game long. They've got to make good on them. They've got to transfer it head north and start cashing in. Here's a shot. Oh, what a stop as he uses his power to swat it away. been putting lots of pucks on net all night long, and they need it here late in the second. Stahl's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. Been a fun night in the barn as we bring an end to period number two, and there's still 20 more minutes of action to go here in regulation. Third period. Don't go anywhere. the puck. When you out-battle, when you out-will your opponent, everyone around you gets energized. Just look at the bench. Everyone is elevated because of that save. And makes a save. Oh, he'll feel that one. There's another stop. Make it three in a row. here in this frame. 2-0 is where we sit. Meter Riders run the face off here in the offensive zone. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. Once the stick engages at the lower half of the leg or within the skates, you know it's going to be a tripping call. And 
their first chance to use the man advantage. Well, they've earned their first power play of the game. A tone setter right here and an opportunity to look at the coverage on the setup. Moves it to Jones. Great quick check on the reach. And the puck departs the zone. Champions got it in the defensive end. Minnesota's got it from behind their own net. Niederreiter's swooping in on the attack. Fires it! Big time save him, goal as he gets all of it with the stick. John's back on the ice and gets a shot on. He's got a little jump. He's in! All alone! Makes the save. Minnesota's got it in their own zone. The Jets gain possession. Changes coming up as they send it in. Feeds the puck to Scandella. Pass to the front. To point blank. A stick save at point blank range by Hillebuck. Scandella is back in the lineup after rehabbing his injury. And he's quick to create some offense there with that nice dangerous shot. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the faceoff. The Jets come up with the defensive zone draw. Gets it out of his own end. Tries to get the puck over to Vanek. Oh, he rocked him on the play. Oh, you know that he felt that one, James. The body is reverberating after it. What a great hit. Shot. Gets a piece of him in the glove. Minnesota's looking to break out. And a stick in the lane. That's that threat. And that somehow stayed out of the net. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Pominville. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Well, he's showing off his skill set, trying to make a silky move around the defender, but he gets denied. Winnipeg's got the puck along the boards. Turned aside with the glove. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Niederreiter's zone ability is a part of his game that can help his team out as they're trailing in this one, guys. Let's see if he can get things going for them. Ehlers is almost back in the play. Winnipeg's PK unit gets their man out of the box. Although they're still trailing, this game is now within reach with that effective kill that gives life to the entire bench. Hellebuck's got the puck, and he's going to slow things down. Well, he's slowing things down because his team has been under siege, James. It's the third period. It's a tight game, and he elects to get the whistle. I like this decision. It's the right one. Now everyone can get a rest, and coach can get the right personnel out there. Minnesota's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Oh, it serves up a little too sweet with that save. Minnesota's been total non-stop action on the offensive end, and they continue to lead in the third. Michaels won the draw, and they're on the attack. The Jets will play from the defensive zone. Looks to pass it to Morrissey. And it's a quick pass to Velarde. Now a quick pass to DeMello. Oh, and look who gets rocked once again. Well, he's a target now, James, because he's got a lack of spatial awareness. You gotta keep your head up if you want to play this game and be safe in it. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. Moves it over to Michael. The Jets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Winnipeg's got it along the wall. Picked up along the boards by DeMello. Quick feed to Perfetti. Here's a blast! And that shot gets caught in traffic. Minnesota's gained the line and into the zone. And that's intercepted by Appleton. The Jets are in a tight game. They gotta start making good on all those interceptions where they've been in great spots and finding ways to get the puck. Doing a great job defensively, but they've gotta convert. Let's get our third member of the broadcast team back in here, our own Carlin Bade. What you got going on? Silverberg's been able to provide some offense in this matchup, guys, so I have to give him the edge in this one. And that's a great heads-up play in the offensive zone. Here's a short pass to Appleton. And that's blocked in traffic. Quick shot. Scores! And just like that, we've got a one-goal game. Well, yeah, I mean, it's much less daunting now, isn't it, James? They're within striking distance to get the equalizer. They're going to have to continue to play aggressive and try and layer some good shifts together.
The Jets dial up exactly what they needed. A goal here in the third. A lot of pushback right now at the latter half of the third period. And you know that the coach is going to make some adjustments. You want to have the opportunity to get your star gifted, creative, offensive players out there when you need to get an equalizer. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Quick pass to Heidola. Slides the puck to chase on. Passes it over to Silverberg. That's a good heads up play at center ice. And they keep the pressure on. And now he moves it quickly to Vanek. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Moves it quickly over to Gustafson. Cuts into the paint. Big time stop. Crisp's gonna give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Minnesota's motor has been non-stop tonight. Lots of shots on net, and they lead in the third. Niederreiters want a big draw on their own end. The Jets have it behind the net. Swing and a miss. Oh, and a great hits up play to burst the turnover by DeHaan. Oh, what a save as he denies them again. He's out battling his opponent right now. He is so dialed in. He's tracking the puck, making save after save. It's about time this team starts working in front of him. here for this face-off. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And he stopped that one. Well, he's extremely dangerous when he has the puck on his stick. He's like a magician and it's on a string. This time, though, the goaltender shuts him down. Oh, what a save as he gets that one, too. They're like a swarm of bees out here with this pressure. And it's intercepted. And there's the whistle ending all that pressure as it sails on recognizing they're still short-handed here as they get ready for the face-off. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And that pulls off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. And they get the puck out of harm's way. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Came up with the save on that play. Driving right to the front! Tangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. There's a hit on the play. And they finally get it out in a much-needed break for the D. Takes a shot. Coverages and knowing exactly how your teammate can skate on 
to that puck, and when you skate onto it, you have some speed. You can get that shot off the way you want, and he capitalizes perfectly. Here in the later stages of this period, Minnesota's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. And now it's grabbed by DeHaan. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. Denies him, he got all of it. It's in the back of the net for an own goal. James, how surprised you think the goaltender is? He just spins around and tries to clear the puck and he fires it past the tender. The Jets have made this a one-goal game here in the third. Might be the final dance in the third period, but there is a lot of runway as this team is on fire right now. And you saw that with that last goal as they're within striking distance. You can feel the energy. It's just up and out of them right now. Tosses it on to Hanola. Broken up at center by Johns. Quick shot. Here's a shot. Glove save. Take possession here in the offensive zone and time to go on the attack. Turn that one aside. Picked up along the wall by Hanola. Oh, those boards rattled after that hit. Wow! And he's rattling as well, James. I mean, we knew that hit was coming, and then all of a sudden, bell, and he's down to the count. Minnesota's looking to close things. Here. They've been the dominant team all night. Hard to see them taking their foot off the gas now. Comes in off the wing as both centers were tied up on the draw. Quick feed to Appleton. Denies him! Goaltender has made his way to the bench. The extra attackers out. They need a goal here big time. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Oh, he hit him on the play. Oh, this is just a thunderous hit. <laughs> that was big time. Final buzzer sounds, and this one's in the books. Well, this team clearly has their eyes on the prize after now taking a second straight win to go up two zip. Yeah, and you know what the talk in the room will be about. It'll be about staying present and in the moment. It's one game at a time, because in order to have killer instinct, you've got to find a way to take care of business today. Not yesterday, today. A fun night of playoff hockey, and these playoffs, well, they have been intense, and they have been electrified so far. We will see you at the next broadcast. For sure, I'm James. Good night.